Hey hi everyone. So we recently visited Egypt in September. Egypt is truly amazing and each of the cities we traveled gave us more of something new. In this video, I want to share the experience of visiting the Egyptian museum at Cairo and watching actual preserved mummies of Yuya and Tuya. According to Egyptian culture, mummification was primarily done by kings or queens. However, Yuya and Tuya were from non-royal families. These mummies were discovered in the year 1905. Here you can see the mummies of Yuya and Tuya. You can clearly see the face, hair strands, nose. All well visible. This was a moment of awe for us to look at these mummies and observe from so close. Here you can see more information on Yuya, his life and how the mummification was done. Yuya was embalmed in a classic way, with his brain removed through the nose by breaking through the ethnic bone into the skull. Resin was poured into his cranium to support and disinfect it. He was eviscerated from the left side and the embalming cut was covered by an oval gold plaque. The eye orbits were filled with resin sneered linen and some linen was introduced into the neck and throat to support it. The skin is also painted with resin. Yuya died between the ages of 50 to 60, quite old for an ancient Egyptian. He was suffering from some back pain when he died. Similar context for Tuya is also mentioned alongside her mummy. Almost similar process was followed for her mummification. Tuya is supposed to have suffered from scoliosis and would have died between ages 50 to 60. That's all from today's episode on Egyptian mummies of Yuya and Tuya. Thanks for tuning in. Please like, subscribe and share the video.